foreign language? At home, independent college prep and it's modern? Come on. It's true, breaking the Spanish barrier and breaking the French barrier do all of this and then some. It's unusual in that vocabulary, grammar, and culture are part of every lesson from the very beginning. The culture makes it high interest. The vocabulary gets words in their head, and the grammar helps your student put those words into thoughts. The program is neutral, traditional, and has low parent involvement. Parents are not expected to know the language for your student to use this program. I tend to think of breaking the barrier as a good choice for the motivated language student, but whether your goal is two years for a graduation requirement or to succeed on a college placement exam, you will learn information about several different countries, loads of vocabulary, and a working knowledge of grammar. There are three levels, each for a solid high school credit. In fact, my opinion as a former high school French teacher is that level three can be split into two years for two credits, so four high school credits total. I ran this idea by the author and he agreed. Each level includes a student work text and answer key, test booklet with answers, phrase book, and an audio component. You can get these in a bundle or separately. Your main source of content is the student work text. If you're not familiar with the term, it's a component that includes both the instruction and written exercises. It's convenient for looking back to review something as you study. I like not having a separate text and workbook. It's super handy. The work text and tests are consumable. These are the printed parts you would replace for a second student. There are 12 lessons per level each taking about three weeks to complete. Expect to spend about 45 minutes three times a week or 30 minutes four times a week. For the student with no previous language instruction, level one has an introduction section including 10 steps to get comfortable with the language. This is about three weeks to complete and it's a crash course on pronunciation and basic conversation. Say your name, learn vowel sounds, ask where you're from and what you like to do, and learn to reply using basic vocabulary like animals, weather, and sports. This part is light on grammar and rules. The idea is to give you some tools going into lesson one. And don't skip this part, even if you've had some language instruction in middle school. It shows the level of expectation for a now independent learner and can be a helpful review also. Every lesson begins with geography, as you're introduced to a country where the language is spoken. You'll see facts about the country, such as the capital, population, industry, money, tourist attractions, and foods. A list of famous people from the country may include current actors, writers, athletes, and artists. The audio portion walks the student through the work text. With the audio, a student has a list of vocabulary to learn. These are grouped by parts of speech and include the masculine and feminine forms when they apply. Next in the lesson are the key grammar concepts with exercises for practice. You'll be conjugating verbs from the very beginning and this is awesome. The sooner you understand verbs, the sooner you can begin to understand what people are saying. Dialogues show the vocabulary and grammar in context. Questions about the dialogue test your reading comprehension. This may be hard for a student at first, and that's okay. Take your time with the lessons at the beginning and get your bearings. Review exercises include answering questions in complete sentences, writing out conjugations, filling in sentences, translating phrases, even finding errors in a paragraph. Now, this sounds challenging, and it is, but it's also fun. Listen to the audio as many times as you need to. Go back and look at the instruction pages too. Take your time with the conjugations and get your spelling perfect. When you check your answers, take time to understand why something was incorrect. An answer key booklet includes reduced student pages with answers filled in. A student can use this to check their own work or you can use it to randomly check a page for them. Since your student is responsible for their learning, it makes sense for them to do the checking and correcting as well. It's instant feedback to show how they're doing so far. The other daily component is the audio-visual element. You hear a variety of native speakers reading sentences and vocabulary words, developing your student's ear to the language. Cristina habla mucho. Mi papá prepara tacos en el restaurante. Online content includes material from the former audio CD plus loads of video examples featuring native speakers. Your student then continues the lesson in the work text, clicking on the various elements when cued by an icon. 
It's important to know you need the work text with the online component, as neither is a standalone program. Where you learn some geography and culture, there are videos to click on and watch. It may be someone going about their work or making a recipe, even demonstrating a local song or dance. Música en el aire de Buenos Aires. En Argentina, hay muchos estilos musicales y a mí me gustan todos, por ejemplo, el tango. A test booklet and answer key round out your kit components. Lesson exams include listening comprehension, writing full sentences in response to questions, conjugating verbs and using grammar and context, translating sentences from English to Spanish or French, and even finding errors in sentences. Every test ends with a composition in the language using new and old grammar and vocab. Tests are reproducible for a single family and test answers are in this packet as well. I like the idea of a student taking the test and grading it themselves with you next to them. Let them talk through the questions with the answer key and tell you how they did. Again, a parent is not expected to know the language for your student to use this program. I think that about covers it. Oh wait, they just added the handy pacing guide for homeschoolers in the single level kits. This gives some examples of grading, test, and lays out lesson components for you. There's also a little laminated phrase booklet for quick reference, but I still recommend a good bilingual dictionary to get through high school. Breaking the Barrier is one of the best homeschool options to prepare a student for further college study, whether they choose to proficiency test out of language requirements or wish to take more classes and jump ahead. You may just have a French or Spanish major on your hands. The combination of reading, writing, speaking, and listening is what you want with a foreign language course. Proficiency comes with practice. Fluency comes with proficiency. Culture makes it engaging and brings it home to your student that people are people, and when you remove the language barrier, you learn so much more. Using vocabulary, culture, and grammar from the very beginning creates a strong language program that can be done independently for solid high school credit. If you have questions about this program or other materials carried by Rainbow Resource Center, please don't hesitate to contact our consultant team by phone, email, or online chat.